Number 23. For which of the reactions in exercise 1315 does Kc, calculated using concentrations, equal Kp, which is calculated using pressures? And then we have this example here. So we have to find out if CH4 gas plus 2O2 gas, which comes to equilibrium with CO2 gas plus 2H2O liquid, does the Kc equal the Kp? Okay, so that's a big question mark here. Well, here's what we need to know. If the Kc equals Kp, that means the gas moles, the number of gases, uh, the moles of gas on the reactant side has to equal the number of moles of the gases on the product side. But it's being very specific. We only care about the gases. So first things first is look at those states. I have a gas. I have a gas. I have a gas, but here I have a liquid. Do I care about this if I only care about the gas moles? No. So get rid of it. Either put the whole, you know, extra the whole thing, or you put an extra the state, but pay no mind to that. Now I need to tally up the total number of moles on the left side and tally up the total number of moles on the right side of the gases. Well, how are we going to find out the moles? That's just the coefficient values, right? So here, I see that I have no number in front of the CH4. That means I have one mole. They told me that I have two moles here. So one, literally plus two, one plus two, I have a total of three moles of gas on my reactant side. Coming over to my product side, I just see I have CO2. I don't have a number in front. That means I have one of them. And I can't use this because that's a gas. So I'm just gonna drop down the one. So I have one total mole on the product side. Three does not equal one, right? Remember, Kc equals Kp only when those moles of gases equal each other. But since three is not equal to one, does the Kc equal Kp? No, not in this case. And that is the final answer, okay. Hopefully this helped. Let me know in the comments. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for viewing the video. I really do appreciate you. And let's keep rocking and rolling. Good luck on all your future tests and quizzes. I'm rooting for you guys. And I will see you all in later lessons. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.